Wir haben 16 der besten Barschangler Europas dazu herausgefordert, in 480 Stunden so viele und große Barsche wie möglich zu fangen. Sie können überall in Europa fischen und drei Tage lang kämpfen die acht Teams 10 Stunden pro Tag und haben dabei insgesamt 480 Stunden reines Barschangeln vor sich. An zwei Tagen wird vom Boden aus gefischt. Dazu ist auch neu, dass sie an einem Tag dazu gezwungen sind, vom Ufer zu fischen. Die letzte Saison bot mit Abstand die herausforderndsten Bedingungen dieses neunjährigen Turniers. Aber sie brachte auch einen neuen Großfischrekord, als Team Bite of Bleak in der letzten Folge einen 51 cm Barsch gefangen hat, was ihnen die glorreiche Trophäe einbrachte. Und in diesem Jahr haben die Teams noch mehr Zeit damit verbracht, zu trainieren und ihre Taktiken zu verfeinern, um ihre Chancen auf den Sieg zu maximieren. Jeden Tag werden vier Punkte vergeben. Der Big Fish Punkt, der Nummer Punkt, der Top 5 Punkt und der Top Water Punkt. Und dazu werden noch zusätzlich vier Punkte am Ende des Turniers vergeben. Einer für die höchste Gesamtzahl an allen drei Tagen, einen für den größten Barsch, der gefangen wurde, und dann noch ein Punkt für die höchsten kombinierten fünf und dann noch ein Punkt für den größten Barsch, der auf Top Water gefangen wurde. Aber bevor wir beginnen, freuen wir uns sehr, euch mitteilen zu können, dass ihr im Juni 2023 an der Perch Pro Open Qualification in Südschweden teilnehmen und die Profis vor einem Live-Publikum herausfordern könnt. Der Gewinner erhält nicht nur 5000 Euro in Bargeld, sondern sichert sich auch direkt einen Platz für die YouTube Edition von Perch Pro. Gleiches gilt natürlich auch für Fly vs. Jerk und Thunder Pro. Weitere Informationen findet ihr natürlich unter tournaments.kanalgratis.se. Das ist Perch Pro 9. Are you ready, Toby? Always ready. Let's go to the first one. ready. Absolutely crazy weather. Lightning hits us. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. <laughs> Sky went nuts. It's raining cats and dogs. It's in yes, the man! It's in the I don't understand what the hell is going on here. It's a really big one. Oh my god! Take it, take it, take it, take it. No! Thank you, Birchcock! It's a perch, it's a perch. It's a really big perch! Yes! Yes! We did it! We found it in Kumblad, I'm scared! Who can Christ, I don't have a single bite here. That's typical Swedish guys are always casting over the line. You just lose the Nana House, it's better to leave them to me. I'm gonna start crying now. This is f***ing unbelievable. Perch Pro 9 wird euch präsentiert von Big Pike Trailers, Premium Bootstrailer aus Lettland. Westgear, ihr Bootshändler in Schweden. One Boat Network, jetzt alle zusammen. Und JR Logistics, Personalvermittlung und Rekrutierung von Lkw-Fahrern und Lagerarbeitern seit 2004. Die acht Teams sind derzeit auf dem Weg zu ihren ausgewählten Orten und in weniger als 30 Minuten werden alle Teams mit dem Fischen beginnen. Das erste Team, das ans Wasser ankommt, sind die Gewinner des letzten Jahres Team Bite of Fleek, aber seit dem Sieg in der vorherigen Saison gingen die Champions Pelle und Peter tatsächlich getrennte Wege, als Pelle anfing, für Shimano zu arbeiten. Diesmal werden die alten Gefährten gegeneinander antreten und zwei verschiedene Teams vertreten, die sich beide dafür entschieden haben, denselben Teil Nordschwedens zu befischen. Team Bite of Fleek besteht aus Peter Fredriksen und seinem neuen Co-Angler Rickard Nomi, einem jungen und aufstrebenden Angler, der seinen ersten YouTube-Auftritt hat. Bite of Bleak ist eine relativ junge Marke, die sich stark auf das moderne Barschangeln konzentriert und immer an vorderster Front dabei ist, die neuesten Techniken zu übernehmen und zu verfeinern. Hallo guys, this is Bite of Bleak signing in. I'm Peter Fredriksson. I'm Rick Nurmi. And as you know, we are the defending champions. We're really feeling the pressure this year, I think. Yeah, everyone is hunting us this year. Yes, that is the real feeling. We are here to protect our title. Yes, but we have good spots then. I think yeah. we will have a good chance. Ja, yeah, absolut. So, we are just lying on one of the spots now in a real clear water lake. We have a depth of like 8 10 meters around us with some rocky terrain under the water. So, now we go for it. In diesem Jahr haben wir detaillierte Wetter- und Bedingungsdaten von allen Teams gesammelt und werden sie in dieser Serie präsentieren. Das Verständnis der Bedingungen und Gewässer, an denen sie angeln, ist wohl die wichtigste Fähigkeit eines Anglers und wir hoffen, dass ihr ein oder zwei Teile findet, die ihr eurem eigenen Puzzle hinzufügen könnt, um ein besserer Angler zu werden. Nicht allzu weit entfernt macht sich auch das Team Shimano mit Palisath und Theory Nguyen bereit, aufs Wasser zu gehen. Theory ist ein unglaublich erfahrener französischer Angler mit einer beeindruckenden Anzahl an großen Fischen unter seinem Gürtel. Mal sehen, ob die Kombination ihrer Französisch- und Schwedischkenntnisse die Erfolgsstrategie in Perch Pro 9 sein wird. Hello everybody, welcome to Perch Pro 9. My name is Pelleset, working for Shimano. And bonjour, 
I am Thierry from France and I'm a French ambassador for Shimano coming for the very first time on Perch Pro and uh, I guess I will catch some big perch here. Yeah, yeah, we are up uh, northern part of Sweden. I have been the Rie to a small lake uh, and we hope to get numbers and of course hit into that big one that everybody's looking for. Uh, last year I won Perch Pro with my old team uh, Bite of Bleak. I know that Peter and Bite of Bleak is up here somewhere and of course this we will we will we want to beat them. Yeah, yeah that's important, you know. So we're gonna do all that we can to give them a, a good fight. We will. We uh, will Mr. 51. Yeah, <laughs> let's go. Let's go. Rund 500 Kilometer weiter nördlich geht das Team Headbanger los mit Markus Teilos und Emanuel Swert in die zweite Saison von Perch Pro. In ihrer ersten Saison fing Markus einen neuen Perch Pro Top Order Rekord mit einem 46 cm Krieger und Emanuel fing einen echten Brecher als Barsch, der die 2 Kilo Marke überschritt. Trotz dieser Erfolge haben sie nicht gewonnen, also sind sie jetzt zurück, um sich endlich zu rächen. Hey guys, uh, welcome back. This is Perch Pro Season 9. Uh, we are Team Headbanglers. My name is Marcus Talos and this is... I'm Anders Swad. And uh, today it's time for some top water action. We are actually in the, like, the middle of the lake on a shallow plateau with a bit, lot of big rocks. We are going to target for the top water with uh, the Spitfire. And we are doing uh, big fish and we're not going for numbers. Never. So, should we go? Yeah, it's time. let's go. Let's go. Die Teams können überall in Europa fischen, aber das nächste Team hat sich auch entschieden, in den nördlichen Teil Schwedens zu fischen. Team Catch with Care hat an allen vorherigen Saisons vom Perch Pro mit einem Sieg in der Tasche aus Saison 7 teilgenommen, als sie in den Niederlanden gefischt haben. Willkommen zurück, Ewart Ostem und Adam Orre. Hi guys, welcome to the first episode of the new season. Season 9. Perch Pro 9. Yes sir. And with me in the boat is... Even those, then. As always, and my name is Adam Orem. We're at the team Catch With Care, and we are not in the Netherlands this year. Not this time. We are in the beautiful country of Sweden. My home country. Beautiful Sweden. Uh, up north, fishing for perch, but we're not going for the big fish. We are all in for the numbers in this season. Gonna stack some 30s. Hopefully we uh, end up in the hundred today. Let's hope so. So first cast is coming up. Stay tuned for Cash with Care. Um das Thema der Perch Pro Veteran fortzusetzen, sind Team Sporting Seaman für eine weitere Runde zurück und sie sind das Team, das Perch Pro am häufigsten gewonnen hat. Good morning and welcome to Perch Pro number nine. We are Team Sporting Seaman Scandinavia. We are armed and ready and ready to yoke with you guys. I am Stefan Nilsson, I'm the owner of Sporting. This is my seventh time on Perch Pro and I'm a three-time champion. And I'm gonna make this number four. The year she I'm fishing with. Thomas, and I'm the sales agent for Scandinavia for Seaman. I'm fishing with Stefan, the Perch Master. We're up in a mid-sized lake in the northern parts of Sweden. We are so excited and we will rock this year, I'm sure. Let's go and get them. Two. Als nächstes kommt ein deutsches Team, das in der vergangenen Saison zum ersten Mal an Perch Pro teilgenommen hat und nach 15 Minuten einen neuen Perch Pro Topwater Rekordbarsch von 46 cm gefangen hat. Kingfisher Angelreisen arrangiert Angelsflüge zu einigen der besten Reiseziele der Welt und jetzt sind sie selber an einem davon, in den mittleren Teilen Schwedens. Good morning guys, welcome to Perch Pro 9. The plan for today is we start with Topwater for like around two hours to hope that we can secure the top water point. Then we just quickly get the boat out, change waters and go out to the Baltic to go for the top five. That's yes. the game plan for to today. Get a good one. Let's get the season started, man. Keep, Keep on, on losing. losing. Das vorletzte Team ist neu bei Perch Pro und repräsentiert tatsächlich ein Land, das noch nie zuvor an kanal gratis turnieren teilgenommen hat. Herzlich willkommen an Team Echolotus.eu aus Lettland, vertreten durch Christian Skodens und Martin Spalodes. Sie sind beide sehr erfahrene Turnierangler mit vielen Titeln in ihrer Tasche und haben 2014 Echolotus.eu ins Leben gerufen. Lettlands führenden Einzelhändler für Sportfischerei und Marineelektronik. Sie entwickeln auch Anhänger für Sportfischerboote, Big Pike Trailers und fischen jetzt in den nördlichen Teilen Schwedens. Willkommen zur Show, meine Herren. 
Good morning. My name is Martins Balodis. And my name is Christians Godin. So we fished together many years. More than 10. We don't remember. Yeah, more than 10, definitely. We won Latvian Championship. Yeah, and we take uh, participation in different uh, international as well competitions and championships. And now we are in Perch Pro. Finally. Finally we are in Perch Pro and we love Swedish Perch. Uh, not just perch. Swedish nature is amazing. <laughs> yeah, and, but perch, perch, but, perch. We focus on perch this but time. They are really get good perches. Yeah. So uh, I think this will be a great show. We want to win. I know it will be hard, but we never <laughs> give up. Yeah, we will fight till the end. Uh, uh, we will look yeah. for biggies, for big, yeah. super perch. And perch. check us out on a short day. It will be interesting. Oh, yeah. That's it. And follow us, team echolotes.eu. We yeah. are ready for battle. Yeah. Das letzte Team ist das einzige, das nicht in Schweden fischt. Stattdessen jagt das Team Neistroft mit Tobias Eckwall und Dustin Schöne den schwer fassbaren Barsch der Niederlande, der ihnen in der letzten Saison beinahe den Sieg beschert hatte. Okay, Tobi, bevor we start Perch Pro, always in the morning, the best sound in the world. Good morning! Are you ready, Toby? Always ready. Let's go to the Born first one. ready! Tobias und Dustin haben in den drei vorherigen Saisons teilgenommen und jagen immer noch ihren ersten Sieg. Sie haben jedes Mal sehr gute Leistungen gezeigt, sind aber immer wieder auf der Ziellinie gestürzt. Letztes Jahr waren sie unglaublich nah dran, als sie einen 50,8 cm großen Monsterbarsch fingen. Nur 0,2 cm fehlten zum Sieg. Mehr Glück diesmal, Jungs. Hello and welcome to our fourth season of Perch Pro. Crazy. And we were so close winning the last year. 0.8 cm more on the biggest perch and we would have won. So our goal today is to catch a big one and win <laughs> <Yeah>. this. <laughs> I mean, the goal is to catch a big one, but we have to say our pre-fishing was always bad, but this time it was bad as hell. Our expectations are not that big, but we hope to, uh, yeah, we will definitely not go for the numbers. We try to catch this one big fish. Every day. Every day. And uh, hopefully top five, and we'll have a special thing on the shore day. Yes. So, some secrets. What's the special thing on the shore day? <laughs> It's a secret. <laughs> yeah, maybe It's a secret. you know more Even than for you. <laughs> Even for you. Okay, so let's get the rods ready. I'm pumped. Even the pre-fishing was not that good. Um, good luck for all the other, other teams. Yeah. Let's go. I want to start now, Dustin. Me too, I'm pumped. <lacht> One minute. Das waren unsere acht Teams und so sind sie über ganz Europa verteilt. Sieben davon in Schweden und ein Team in den Niederlanden. Es ist bald 8 Uhr und die Teams können mit dem Angeln beginnen. 3, 2, 1, Let's zero. go! First time cast, is, time, is, nine. time is 8. Well, hello. Time is 8, we are ready to start. First cast. First cast, roll out. Team Catch Sweet Care is on the move. First cast of our fifth perch pro. Make it count, Toby. It's 8 o'clock in the morning. We're gonna take the first cast. And reps rock now. First cast. Good cast. fight. Yep. Watch us. So it's time, Richard. First it's cast. Time. First cast. Perch pro. Which perch pro is it? Perch pro? Nine, I think. Nine. <laughs> yeah, okay. So, first cast. Fight Oblique doing the first cast. First pro. Nine. Nine. Let's, Let's go. go. Boom. Hold on to your horses. Yeah, I think the other teams is going for the bigger fish today. I think first day is really important to have this big fish with you for the rest of the competition. So, I think we should see the other teams going for the big one today. Yeah. I don't know if are. some... Do you think somebody is going for the numbers today? Like totally going for the numbers. I don't know. We have a new team with us this year, and I have yeah. no idea what they are doing or where they are. We are starting our first Perch Pro. We are starting with Tofoters. This is good place for Tofoters because this is a shallow area uh, with some we grass, and small. there is there is Perch. First Perch on first cast. <laughs> I'm not happy, but it is a first Perch. And I hope it's the smallest in this championship. Yeah, but as I told, that the place is very good for top water because there is grass, there is cutted trees, there is shallow area, and goes deep. 
This is a place where big ones come up for bite fish. If it doesn't work, we will go deeper. Okay, guys, we start with the topwater lure. It's a wake prop from Norris. We catch the several good ones. So we are here actually fishing and it's right in the middle of a lake. And um, yeah, the structure comes all up from 10 meters around. It's like a little plateau. But this is usually the ground where they chase. So let's see what this day brings. Whoa. Ooh. Oh. What the f Ah <laughs> oh, man, that's goosebumps all around. And off she goes. Top water action sofort, aber die Mindestlänge für einen Barsch, um einen Perch Pro zu zählen, beträgt 30 cm, also immer noch kein zugelassener Fisch auf dem Scoreboard. Alright, we are on our first spot. We have a little bay in here. And we have a little bit of a weed line and some weeds in the water here. And it's like from, from three to two meters. And we have packed with, with bait fish in here. And also we have perch in here. So we're going to start here to see if they are going to be active for us. I'm going to start using the, the Shimano World Minnow. It's a super, super good moving, suspending jerk bait. Uh, going to tell you later a little bit more about what's in this beauty. Let's go. I'm using this popper with a flash boost action because it active the perch sometimes very well. So let's try. Let's go. All right, guys, I think the condition was not... What yes, we... one on top order. Great, 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 great. Not big one. Oh, shit. She has gone. <laughs> but it shows they can go on yeah. the top. I have one following it. They are Crazy. not into it. Yeah, I need to change a little bit. We think that we're not the only team that's going for the numbers. We think, mostly, that the rest of the guys, um, let's see, like five or six teams, they're gonna go for, uh, for big fish, maybe some top water, stuff yeah. like that. We expect that uh, at least one team is in the Netherlands, hunting for the big fish. A lot of teams will go for maybe big fish and numbers. That's our hope, because we are going all in for numbers. I hope we are the only team going for the numbers today. Yeah, and the big ones. <laughs> yeah, always the big ones, but there are numbers here, we know that. Just need to find the school of them and catch some numbers. Yeah, good one. That's yeah, good. really good. Really good? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yes! So, oh. hello, mother! <laughs> I know you was there. Oh. Yeah, that's a solid fish. It's so nice to have in the beginning. That's a good perch. Really good one. Stand up, gig head. The scorpion gig head. Yeah. Put her on the board. Zweifellos der erste zugelassene Barsch des Turniers. Sieht zumindest eher aus wie ein 40 Plusser. 4 to 5. Really good perch. Yeah, nice fish. Jawohl, der erste zugelassene Barsch des Turniers geht an Team Bite of Bleak und was für ein Start. Eine 45 cm große Schönheit, die für ihre Top 5 sehr wichtig sein könnte. Took the Pope in Albino Ayo color with a stand-up jig head with titanium fins on it. So it will always stand up in the water. Really good bait and head. So we need to make a click. Now we go. We're gonna fish this uh, drop-off. It's like a plateau that's like five, six meters. And there we have found a lot of perch in the pre-fishing. Uh, we have heard about the 53 centimeter perch caught there last week. One, one week ago, exactly. Oh, so. they are here. Oh. Oh. Ooh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. A lot. Should we go for the numbers? <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't think we will maybe catch. I, I would guess if, if we catch five today, we're lucky. Yeah, I think that's almost not possible to catch five. But hey, we will see. You never know. They would are be here. Nice. They yeah. are here. In the pre-fishing, we had the best fishing. Well, we have fishing aggressive. So I'm fishing a hard bait with hard uh, twitches. They for sure are here to the right. Yeah. At the moment, I fish quite aggressive um, because the fish are not really active. I try to trigger them, but in a couple of minutes, if this 
shows no effect. I will, um, yeah, go a bit slower. First I do a tube and then maybe I do Carolina rig or normal jig. So we have to try around a bit because as pre-fishing uh, showed us, it's really, really tough. It's this one big fish we can catch here, or if we are really lucky, but I think that's almost impossible, we can catch five big fish. We will see. We have to be really concentrated the whole day because it's this one bite which can make the difference. Oh, I want, I want. Good one, Ned. It's not that big, but it's a, it's a keeper. Keeper. Yes! Uh, but, but yeah, it's good. Could be good for our top five. No, but they are here. That's a good sign. Yeah, for sure they are here. It was quite close to the boat, and I said they were on the right side. Very good, Toby. First yeah. fish. At least we caught one. I think it's 40. Yeah. yeah. I think it's 38. But it's a beautiful fish. No, you're right. 38. But yeah, they are here though. Good. Now we just need to catch the 53 that they caught here one week ago. Yeah. I'm just gonna release it, release it quite fast because it could be a bite period now. Yeah. Nicht der 53 cm Barsch, auf den sie aus sind, aber da das Prefischen extrem langsam war, ist das ein gutes Zeichen dafür, dass sie überhaupt Fische fangen. 38 cm ist ein netter Fisch, aber im Pratch Pro wird es ihnen nicht viel helfen. Um eine Chance auf den Top 5 Punkt zu haben, müssen in der Regel alle 5 Fische größer als 45 cm sein, um im Spiel zu sein. Manchmal bevorzugen die Großen eine subtile Repräsentation, also beschließt Dustin, den Prototyp der Nace Tubes auszuprobieren. So, changing to a tube. Very nice action, like darting action, if you see it in the water. Perch really love it. And I'm fishing the uh, Straft S-Line. I love it because it's really smooth and uh, makes no noises. That's a perfect combination. We'll see if the Perch like the tube. But the training showed us they don't like much. They're really gourmet at the moment. But I think I should stick to the hard bait fishing quite fast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do it. I think at least one should fish uh, quite fast and aggressive and the other one can fish slow. But it didn't took the bait, uh, uh, the bait where you were letting it down. It, you were retrieving it, right? Oh. Perch. Good perch. Very good perch. Yeah. Be, that's way bigger than yours. If you wait, is it very close? I can't wait. It's, it's way bigger. It's huge. Yes, I have it. It's a really big one. It's a really big one. Oh my god! Take it, take it, take it, take it. No! Fuck. I couldn't take it. I know. Oh. That was the 50, right? Uh, could have been, yes. That has been the 50 we needed. F f fun. I know I'm over your line, but I will. No problem. <sighs> oh no. <laughs> I'm crying. I'm laughing on the outside and crying on the inside. Or at least, no, I'm crying both inside and outside. F oh no. I'm shaking. Me too. Shaking, fuck! I can honestly don't do anything. No, I saw that. It was way too far away for you. And it was strong. They are so strong in here. Oh, that's the worst in the competition. You know, as I said earlier, you get this one chance. We have to be concentrated. That might have been can the 50. No, I, I'll go here. I lost it. But what to do? That's fishing. No, everybody said it. I think already. I'm a bit uh, sad now. <laughs> I could cry to be honest, because the pre-fishing was so peep hot. Yeah. Ah. We just need to get another one. Let's do it, Toby. Yeah. How hard can it be? Just catch another 50. Fang einfach noch ein 50er. Sehr leicht gesagt, etwas schwieriger durchzuziehen. 
Einen solchen Fisch zu verlieren, wenn man weiß, dass man vielleicht nur eine oder ein paar Chancen pro Tag bekommt, ist der größte Schmerz für jeden Angler. Im Norden hoffen Team Headbanger Lewis auch darauf, dass dieser eine große Fisch ihre Köder attackiert. Actually, we're going to like stay on this spot the entire day. Uh, the plan is that uh, because we know that the big fish are here. It's a natural like feeding spot for them. Uh, and we are actually like standing on top of some really big uh, rocks over here. You can see them uh, in the water. It's a plateau going out from one and a half meters out to 12 meters. It's a very strategic spot for the fish to come up and hunt. And it's a good spot for the bait fish to hide. And sometime during the day, the perch will hunt and then we want to be here. When I'm fishing top water and I don't see the fish hunting in the surface, I keep casting the same direction to draw the fish out, casting the same line over and over again for like 10 cast or so before I change direction. Sometimes I can trigger the fish. Let's see if it works today. I go with a Seaman Turd, TRD Finesse. I'm fishing with only a six gram head. So it takes quite a long time to reach the bottom. There we go. First fish. Way to go, Thomas. Yes. Ready, Danskian? I'm ready. Let's get the net. Is it a good one? That's okay. No, ah, it's a. It's okay size. So it's good size. Good size. First thing. Boom. There you go. Thank you. <coughs> Keep on fishing. Second cast. Fish on. Fish on for Danskin also. Yep. Okay. This is a small one. Yeah. It's smaller. It's a no net. This is a small one. There you go. Third. June bug. Wet the board. 41. 41 and a half. So it's a 41. This one's uh, 30... 33. So it's a proof fish. Hit the clicker. Hit the clicker one here also. Es sind erst 15 Minuten am ersten Tag vorbei und einige der Teams haben wirklich gut angefangen, während andere ein bisschen Probleme haben. Einer von ihnen ist Shimano, die immer noch null zugelassene Fische auf dem Brett haben. Und nein, leider kann man die Länge nicht addieren, wenn man zwei Barsche mit einem Wurf fängt. Okay, they're starting to bite, but they're just a little too small. So. We maybe need to search a little bit around this area because we have a lot of small fish here. This may be. Yeah. Should yeah, be probably. approved. Do you want the net? Oh, it's it's a bite. <laughs> no! <laughs> yes, I know, I know. Take it easy, I come. Oh, the pike, you saw that? Yeah. They came after your lure? It's oh. a big pike. Yeah. Jesus, you have to you have to film this. Okay, shit, the pike is coming. The pike is. Oh. 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 I had a perch on, and the pike came and took it. <laughs> you can all see that on the Mega Live. It was a big pike. Oh, f big pike. <laughs> oh shit! Did he hit it? Yeah, he has my perch. Oh, now we're in some trouble, guys. <laughs> I have a big pike on my perch. And it's a clicker perch. Richard Nurmi, the pike fisherman. Sometimes you're glad you have powerful rods. But now... Yeah, I think he let my perch go. Yeah. Yeah, it's a clicker. Yeah, nice fish. They have a 34. My first clicker in perch, bro. How is feeling? Feeling good. Good feeling? Yeah, really good. I was a bit nervous. <laughs> Changed lure two times already. <laughs> In how long time? 15 minutes? Yeah. Really good strike. Mm. She had turned lure upside down. So really good strike. Really angry today. Hard to measure. Yeah, good fish. Good fish. This is good one. Yeah. This is really good one. Oh. Try to bring it up. Ah, it's a good fish. You're smoking hot. It's also even stronger than the first one, but this is smaller. But it's a good perch. She had been through some stuff. 
Yeah, she's old warrior. Been hunted by pikes all her life. Four to one. Four to one centimeter perch. Old warrior. Like always, when fishermen didn't catch a fish, it depends to the weather or the water or the fishes, but not to the fishermen. But we have a. The air pressure drops down. We had good conditions the last days, but we have to deal with it. We try to cast and cast and cast and cast because we know we have good fishing here. And uh, that's what we can do. Do another cast. What we basically do is, of course, we hope and wait for chasing fishes. But if they are not active, we kind of activate them with the sounds of the topwater lures. So especially with this very loud prop bait and the popper, it sometimes makes like click right away and the sound just makes them crazy and the hunt is on. So even as Matthias said, right now it's a little bit slow, but we try to, you know, activate them and get some action. That's the plan and it's not working out within whatever, the next couple of minutes. We've got still two spots left, so yes, let's see what comes. Ooh. Perch. Oh, yeah, the perch? Yeah, I think so. Tell me if I need the net. Oh. Good one. Can you give me the net? Sure. Oh, maybe it's the first clicker. Oh, yeah, it should be a clicker. Yes. Oh, bra, Henke. Good job, man. At least we've got a topwater fish. The first topwater counter of the day. I love those fishes. It's a 35. Put them in the live well. Keep on using the first click on the wake prop. First one. First fish. Second fish. Put the spot lock. Ooh. Edge ball. Long fish. Double strike. That's how we do it. I will check it, but I this think it's... This one is not 30. Small. 28. And I'm using the new uh, Strike Pro spin tail. Really nice lure that's racking up some kills lately. Yeah, this is approved. Yeah. Yeah, first approved fish. Yes, ladies and gentlemen. First click. First fish on the board on the Astro Vibe. Using the big one, right? The 26 grams? Yeah. First fish, Birch Pro 9. Fish in the boat. Boom. Yeah. Erste Klicker für Team Catch with Care. Sie haben einen langen Weg zum 100. Barsch, aber es bleibt noch viel Zeit. Das Team Echolotus.eu hat die 30 Pluser noch nicht gefunden, aber jetzt sehen Sie einen Schwarm anständiger Barsche an der Oberfläche jagen. It's first clicker on uh, popper, 31. Small, but still it counts. Smaller one again. It's a gangster. Not very big, but the proof. Yep. Fish on. Ah, there you go. Third, June bug. The board is still wet. Fish, Fish on. on. Good size. Nope. Gangster. 38. Fish. I'm a little worried for the engine. This is a better size, I think. Down scan. Yeah, you need my help. Yeah, this is good, better. This is a good one. Better at least. Better at least. Yeah, it's a good one. Super. Boom, high five. <laughs> There we go. Biggest for the day. It spits out a small perch. So they're eating perch. You see the turd in the mouth. Let's measure it. It's a 45. Yes. Team Sporting Siemen fand einen neuen Trupp aktiver Barsche und in nur wenigen Minuten überholten sie Team Bite of Bleak auf dem Top 5 Board. Unten in den Niederlanden jagen Team Nestroft ihren zweiten Barsch. Oh, oh, big one. Big one. This is a good one. It's going deep. Oh, 
shaking. Yes! Oh. It's nice, oh. yes! No, I thought it was gonna be bigger. But still, we're catching them. I'm gonna, now this time, I'm gonna remove the hook from the net already now, if you catch another one. Yeah. So it's not tangled. Yes, Toby! That's so good. At least we start catching a fish. Oh, it's such a relief. Let's see how long it is. I say 42, 44, 45. Ooh, quite oh, no. good. Maybe. 40, maybe it could be 45. Ah, no, it's 44, 43. Yeah, we'll see, but it's, it's a fat one. It's a nice fish. It's heavy for its weight. Heavy for its weight? Length, you mean? Length. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's, no, it's 45. It's 45. If we catch, if this is the smallest one, I think we might get the top uh, five point. But yours was bigger than this one. Well, mine was bigger, yeah. So it was 48 to 50, I would say. Yeah. Let's put it back. Hopefully they continue biting and hopefully the big one I lost is hungry again, maybe in one hour. But it's good, very good that Toby at least caught one. Toby, that's typical Swedish guys are always catching, uh, casting over the line. Dustin, you're casting a lot to the right. I yeah, of like... course, because you said the fish is to the right. Like, yeah. Of course I catch, cast where the fish is. Where they are more. Dustin, you are casting to the fish. Why do you do that? Okay, Toby, next time I do in the empty water behind us, okay? You just lose the anyhow, so it's better to leave them to me. <laughs> you know why I put a big hook? Uh, when you put the big hook, the small ones just grab it until here and can't take it in so easy. And then they uh, warm up the bigger coming, ones. Coming, coming. It looks like one more clicker. Probably. It's clicker. Yep. Opposite side? Yep. And this will be definitely clicker. It's 33. Second one. So, one more, please. Boom. Not you. Where is your old brother? Opa. This is not small. This Good. runs up and this is a clicker, I believe. Yeah, Chris, check out. Okay. Yep. This is a better. This is much better than the 30s. This can be close to 40. Yep. Yep. Good. Hello. Good. Good. Fantastic gray color. This is, this is li a deep living fish. Uh, if it would be shallow, it would be much more colorful. Number three, and for Martins as well. So we have six perches. And this is just beginning. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There is bite fish, yeah. That's why there is a really nice school. Big, 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 big. Net? I have net, it's okay. okay. Just work out. I saw him coming out from the... It's okay. It's good, yeah. <laughs> this is crazy. It's hopefully will be clicker for me as well. This is going to be a little more than 39. You see? This is a little more than 39. This is 39. It's 36 and a half. <laughs> they are super active. Yes. Die Newcomer aus Lettland sind im Spiel. Nach einem langsamen Start in Richtung des top order punktes haben sie ihre Taktik geändert und besitzen nun tatsächlich den Top-5-Punkt. Aber die dreifachen Champions Sporting Seaman planen nicht, so leicht besiegt zu werden. I'm changing. I want to see if I can catch a little bigger fish. I'm going for the, the peak hula, Mr. Jump Jump. And as a skirt, bait from CNW baits, Rocket Buck. I bite up the head because I want to get in a little bit more tight to the body, ready to rock. This one I like because it has gold, the spoon is of gold. Nice one, jump jump, peak hula. Let's see if they want to bite the bladed jig today. Let's see. Ah, it's nice. Boom! Good one. Good one. Ah, boom. Nice. Put it on. Super. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. There you go. Oh yeah, baby. This was good. This was what we needed. Yes. That's this nice one. what the one. 
Super. The gold blade. Gold oh, blade. this is a tank. Come on, baby. Woo Look at it. Look at the jump jump, the peak cooler. It totally inhaled it. This is a nice one. That's a nice one. That's a nice fish. Oh, I love that. Oh, yeah. Chains, the golden blade and, and the white trailer, specially made for me, white with pearl. Just love it. Gold blade, peak hula. Jump, jump, jump. This one's 46. There you go. Nice. Beautiful fish. Tank. Sporting Seaman ist wieder an der Spitze und hält sowohl den Top 5 als auch den Big Fish Punkt. Es ist 9 Uhr, was bedeutet, dass die Teams bereits eine Stunde gefischt haben. Okay guys, so it's 9 o'clock, so it's time for the first report. Can you help me remember how many fish do we get? Yep. Zero approved. <laughs> Zero approved. Yes, keep casting. We have two good purchases now on the paper, but I'm still stressing a little bit. We, we are not catching the numbers that, that we expected to do at this point, but still two plus 40, that is good. Good start, first hour. Yes, twi twice again. Double. Double again. <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> double. Small, that double. We need to find the big ones. Yes. So, nine o'clock, we have been fishing for one hour now. Change to uh, the crankbait, the World Rush. It's a new, new uh, crankbait, almost like a square bill. Um, and they react on it, but I think the purchase is too small. We're standing on a shallow place and, and fishing out over and it's go down to six to seven meters. And I hope to get, get some reaction on the way up when we're fishing the, the crankbaits. So it's a little bit after nine, we are at a new spot. It's like a little channel where two rivers get together. And um, you see a lot more surface activity here. The perches are hunting. Yeah. So we had very good uh, pre-fishing here in this area. We hope we can get a fish on here too. I might change because Matthias is catching better with the wake prop. So I might change to a bigger lure too. Maybe to like walk the dog action to try this because the popper is not running well at the moment. So um, yeah, we give the spot a try for half an hour or something. And then we go to a third spot for top water before we head to the, to the Baltic Ocean. Oh, Oh, that's a good one. Oh, my. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Take it easy. Take it easy. <laughs> oh, that was a hard strike. Take it easy. Ay, ay, ay. Hit the first, right? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> good job, man. Let him go. Thank you. As you see, the wake prop again. Ooh. <laughs> that's a nice fish. Ah, yeah. Yes, man. It's a really nice perch. It's a 38. A really lovely one. Whoopa. Good job, man. Do oh, stuck. Oh, shigo. Oh. oh, get it, get it. Got it. Oh! Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, 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 no. The pike, is too the pike is still there. The pike is still behind them. No, no, don't you see him? Yeah. We spooked him because we need to fish. Oh. <laughs> oh my God, you saw that? Yeah, yeah, he was just right under the perch. Oh, the click the wake So, here we are. Another nice perch. Is it a 38? No, it is a 37. No. 37. I'm still going with the topwater bait because we're hunting for that point. It's an extremely important point for us. So I will maybe be casting the topwater for the whole day. Yeah. Uh, what do you think about the other teams, Simone? What they are up to? Or anyone like chasing the topwater point like we do? Probably at least one or two of the other teams. What do you think about Kingfisher Angler Racer? Yeah, they will probably go for the topwater yeah. this year again. I mean, we're tied with them with the biggest top water uh, perch in perch pro history, so it can't be like that. We need to change that. Oh, 
one. Oh. oh, it's a perch? I think, I'm not sure. I think it's a perch, but it feels like a pike. If it's a perch, it's a giant. It's more like pike, to be honest. No, it's, no, it's, it's a perch. A perch! Oh, holy shit. Oh my. Ay, ay, ay. Oh. Let's get it in. It's in yes, there! Bro, Henke! We needed this one. Check so. this one out. <laughs> Holy smokes, I'm shaking, man. Oh, oh, that's a giant, isn't it? Oh, 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 that is a huge fish. Holy shit. Check the beauty, oh. man. Oh. Okie dokie. Oh see. my god. How big is it? Do you guys are here? It's like a 40. It's a 45. It's a 45. Five. That's the big fish spot, man. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, Henke. Oh, I'm so pumped, man. Ooh. 45 cm Topwater Tank von Team Kingfisher Angelreisen Camo Tackle. Kein neuer Perch Pro Topwater Rekord, aber er schafft es in die Top 3 und ist definitiv der bisher größte Topwater Fisch von Perch Pro 9. Tolle Arbeit, Marius. Oh, man, I'm still looking at my hands. I'm still goosebumps everywhere. It's so nice, this spot is just so cool. And we are really happy to have a 40 on top water. This might bring us hopefully a point. This is actually the lure I caught the perch with. It's the, I mean, it's pretty rubbed off here in the end, but it's still working. It's actually one of my favorite colors. And this is the uh, tough bug from Norris. This fish actually took it twice. He missed it, turned around, took it again. It was insane. Here it is. Okay guys, changed to soft bait. We had a really struggling first hour. And uh, now, Terry also hooked up, so we really have... Okay, also can be good. No, oh, it's good. So it's we good. changed plates. I think it's our first approved one, closed mouth, and we have a 36. First on the paper for us. Great. Really, really Great, happy. mister. Really happy with us. It's a big one. No, oh, it's good. First one validate. Perch. For you. We were in a shallow place, uh, there is so much small one perch, so we went deeper and uh, we saw some of them on the, on the bottom, so I went to drop shot with a creature. Endlich die ersten beiden Fische auf dem Brett für Theory und Pelle mit 42 und 36 cm. Der Versuch im Flachwasser auf Zahlen zu gehen hat nicht geklappt, aber mehr Finesse-Darbietungen im tieferen Wasser scheinen zu funktionieren. Yeah, really good, really good. <laughs> Long and nice game fish. 43, yeah, it's 43. Took on the drop shot with a tiny. Like this, out. Was standing just on the inside of the rock. Yeah, but you threw a little bit longer last time. Because now you're on the rock. No, I think I'm perfect now. Look, look now. <laughs> A good one. High 30. No, this is a 40. Nah, no, maybe not. Maybe not. 40. 41. Two casts in a row. Catch me two 40 pluser. Really nice. Just inside of a, a drop of, of a big rock we are lying on. They were standing. What I did was to switch to, to drop shot because we feel that the, we don't get the bite as we should get. And we see the fish on the sonars and everything. So I changed the drop shot and then we moved around a little bit, put ourselves on a big rock and I could just throw like a five meter cast and let the drop shot go down in the pocket just below the stone where the bottom flattens out and just keep it there for a long time with the drop shot. So that's was really success in this case. So catch two, 40 pluser on this and the tiny they bite on in the color uh, smoke aisle. So let's see if we can catch some more. Toby and I have different tactics. I fish quite slow with a rubber jig and a craw. Toby fishes quite aggressive and from now uh, he catches really good with aggressive lures. We still try to do different things. Yes. To see 
what works best. Because nothing is really working. No. Push. Big perch. Really big perch. F it's a huge perch. That's a 50 maybe. Good work. It's not the 50, but it's the big one. Where did you catch it? Yeah, but where did it cost? <laughs> yeah. It was close to the boat. Yes! That's an important fish. Woo! Well done, Dustin. Ah, it was a st really strong one. Took the craw, nice craw. Oh, fuck. I think it's a, quite long, Dustin. Such a beautiful fish. Look at these big fish. Gris. Very beautiful fish. Mouth is closed. Right? Yes. Closed? 45. 45. Very important fish for the top five. Ah, beautiful fish. That's why we stay in the Netherlands, because you have such fat fish that it's hard to get anywhere else in Europe. It took the craw on the skirted jig. I really love this lure when it comes to perch fishing. Well done. Well. Yeah. Okay, guys, 10 o'clock report. Biggest fish is 42, and total top five is 118. The, the forecast has been a little problem for us. It's quite windy, picking up wind, and, and the pressure is falling, it's dropping, so that will not be a good thing. But I have one thing it's when you have low pressure, the big fish will eat because the, the, the small fish will affect more to the low pressure. So probably a big one soon. So let's go get it. There we have them. Nice. There we have them. Really good. This is three beauties. Okay, we'll try. Come on, Bella. 10 meter range. Yeah, it's good cost. It's really good cost. Probably we will able to strike it now. Yeah, they're coming. Yep, you got them. Yep. Perch? Yeah, good one. This is a... An approach. One is following, maybe. Daddy, one is following, maybe, if you we will try. You, you prefer? Yeah, 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 yeah. No, he's by himself now. He's by himself. Yeah, the other one go. But they will also take. This is a good one. It's a 40. Yeah. Yes. Bam! The other one is behind. The other one is really behind. Behind. Drop down. Oh, drop well, down. that's not very good. He's dead. You see him. You see him. Drop down. Drop down. There, there, outside there. He's coming, he's coming, he's coming. Yeah, good. It's one more. <laughs> oh my god, bro! Oh my god, it's a 50 plus! It's a 50 plus! <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Look at that one! <laughs> great, 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 so oh, great! Oh, two beauties! This is a 50 plus! Yeah. <laughs> Just missed the 50? Yeah. I don't, uh, uh, I don't uh, uh, know. Uh, uh. We, we will see. <laughs> we will see. Uh, <laughs> maybe 40. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah, no, no. It's, one. Look at this that. one. This one is really old one. Oh, great. Let's see. Let's time to, to, to measure. To measure. Yeah. yeah, we check the small one first. And it's a 43. And then we check. Oh. No, it's not 40. 50. No, it's not 50. No. It's a 46. 46. I thought it was bigger. Next one. Yeah. Next one will be 50. Yeah, but 46 is good. Oh, no. oh it looks so long. Oh, it looks so old and long. Yes. A little bit disappointed. Yes, but... But it's a really beautiful fish. But for, 46 uh, for me, and 40. it's looked uh, like um, the um, lo yeah. last year one. So long. 43 and 46 is... Can't be. 
Nun, das passiert dem besten von uns nicht so groß, wie sie zuerst dachten, aber das sind zwei großartige Fische mit 43 und 46 cm, die Team Shimano zusammen mit Sporting Siemen den Big Fish Punkt sowie den Top 5 Punkt mit 207 cm bescheren. Die Teams haben zweieinhalb Stunden gefischt und um 12 Uhr werden sich die Teams gegenseitig anrufen und ihre Ergebnisse bekannt geben. We have one and a half hour left of this first episode until the lunch report comes. What do you think, Richard, about the rest of the teams? Probably they are going to fish better than we have done. You think morning. so? Yeah, I think we're really struggling out here. I hope we're not alone with this kind of struggling this morning. I don't know. I think we're after in numbers, but yeah. we will take that back. I think once we find a fish. Team Bite of Bleak liegt mit sieben Barschen zahlenmäßig weit zurück. Catch with Care stapelt 30er Barsche hintereinander und hat schon 29 zugelassene Barsche auf dem Board. Wenn sie in diesem Tempo weitermachen, werden 100 Fische nicht unmöglich sein. Team Echolotus.eu ist mit 25 Fischen nicht weiter hinter, aber das Team mit der höchsten Anzahl ist derzeit Sporting Siemen mit 32 zugelassenen Barschen. Unten in den Niederlanden versuchen Tobias und Dustin verzweifelt, zwei oder drei weitere große Fische auf das Brett zu bringen. Aber der niederländische Barsch kann extrem schwierig zu fangen sein. Sie wissen genau, dass die Großen da sind, also präsentieren sie immer wieder verschiedene Köder und Techniken in der Hoffnung, einen anderen zum Anbeißen zu bringen. Please bring it in, Toby. Wow. You saw it? Yeah. Really big one. I'm nervous. Me too. What the f? That's a monster. Yes! yes! Ah. Not a 50, but it's such a nice fish. Yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes, Toby. I net that for you. I wet it. You oh. net it and you wet it. I net it and then I wet it. And now I catch you another one. Oh, it's quite big, isn't it? Yes, it's 45 plus. Yes, Toby. Oh, yeah, it's long. It's in a super fat as well. Oh, it's, it's really big. Maybe it's a 50? No. no, 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 no. Don't jump into the water. I'm gonna try to unhook. Oh. You see, this, this layer is go quite good, Dustin. Yeah. Your nice sleepless crank. I don't it works. I just want to. Make sure the net is ready if you catch another one. <laughs> oh, that's such a big fish. I think it's the biggest from today. Don't do that, please. It's <laughs> fatter than mine. That's why. Oh, such a good fish. Let's see how long it is before I drop it in the water. Yeah, it's closed. Yeah, 47. And it's such a heavy, beautiful fish. I think it, for the Swedish viewers, I think this one weighs like 1.9, maybe yeah. two kilo, because it's, it's super heavy. Yeah. But I wouldn't say two kilo, maybe 1.9. Let's put it back. That's so good to be really. It's so freaking good. Team Naysdroft is on fire. Eine weitere Schönheit für Tobias auf dem Nays Lipless Crank und mit 47 cm stehen sie den Big Fish Punkt mit einem Vorsprung von einem cm. Noch ein Barsch und sie werden für den Top 5 Punkt sehr gefährlich sein. Es ist nach 11 Uhr, also sind wir in der letzten Angelstunde vor dem Telefonbericht. Ja, yeah, we changed location and we found new fish. I'm fishing with a worms, Seaman Finesse Worms in the color PBG. What are you fishing with, Danskan? I uh, do a bladed jig, a peak hula. It's a little tough to find the fish. We find them. Ah, there's fish! It's not a super big, but at least it's a fish. Uh, maybe it's a good size. Yes! Kaboom! Shagaboom! <laughs> Free drinks in the house! There we go. Suddenly it happens, but this, it's not a super size, but it's a good size. Yeah, it's a good size. Really slow fishing down in the bottom with the finesse worms that I cut about two, three centimeters from. And this little purple color, green flakes. Nice, 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 nice. Let's see how long it is. No, uh, long. 44. 45. 45. Super nice fish. Right? Yeah, it's a good one. 
This is a good one. Yeah, super. I don't Come know out. how big, but it's a good one. I don't think it's a tank, but it's a good one. Ah, uh, it's a nice one. Nice size. Look here. It's just goggled it all the way down. Finesse head, CNW rocket buck, special pearl white. It's a 42. 42. Small one. They are uh, striking here at least. That's good. We're fishing on a really steep rock that's sticking up out of the water and going straight way down to 11 meters. So. Yeah, we are on 11 meters now, right? Yeah. No, we're on 8.5. Yeah, good fish. This is good fish. Yeah, yeah, this is good. Good one. This is. This is good one. Yeah, it is. It's a really good one. Really nice fish. Yeah. Mama! Yes! That's so hot today, I don't get it. You said it was a big fish there, so I thought, yeah, I yeah. might take it. Oh, a small one. Just hooked in the lip. Mouth against, 45. Yeah, proved. Yeah. So, one other more 45 fish today. So we have two on the paper now. And uh, yeah, we're getting happy with that. I'm fishing a drop shot rig now with the banger ribs because the fish are pretty slow. So I want to do a slow presentation and be able to keep the bait in the same position for a long time. I know that the fish are around and it's just a matter of time until they start feeding. Nice. Nice. On the drop shot. First cast. <laughs> yeah. I think this might be our first approved fish on the banger ribs. Nice. Maybe this is what we have to do until they start eating from the surface. Nope. <laughs> Shit. You can't do that with a 50. Nope. <laughs> That's like restrict, really forbidden. <laughs> <laughs> Drill him. <laughs> what you doing, guys? Drill him. Mr. McGeezers? Two clickers. Yeah. Tail is here, 38. Nice fish. Call it on the uh, atomic chicken piglet shed. No. Uh, 38 centimeters, the biggest so far. Really happy with the fish. Quick release and then keep on hammering. We are in a good spot now and uh, that, what, that's why we put the big bait on. Because it sorts out the small ones, you see, it's bended again. So, and the big bait uh, really helps to get away from the non -certies. So, And give you some 40s too. It sounds like 35, 37, not 40 plus. Oh, oh maybe 40. Okay. Hello, my hey, my friend. You you see that roach? Oh. Don't afraid about this big bite. Don't afraid about the big bite. It's a nice perch fishing. Not too big. It's a it's a clicker of 39. Yep. So, uh, but so so strong guy. You see the muscles are. Oh, I will eat again that big roach. So go eat it. Okay. As you see, we have. Uh, uh, several boxes. Uh, this is a motor box, this is Bicebury's box, and this is quantity box. When we find a good school of perches and they are active and they are not very picky, then we go for quantity. Wolf Creek, there is Bassassin, Gator, and so on. And, but when it gets more harder to get the bites, it's possible to choose super natural colors from Bicebury's. This is six inch and it's very good for a big perch as well. Those are five inches. It's so salty and moves a lot. But when we found the bigger school and the activity is going on, then it's needed to change for not so soft rubber. It moves as well, very good, but it stays on hook longer. That means that it's possible to keep casting, keep casting and keep the tempo. And tempo is very important when you are fishing their perches, and then you can easily oh my go God. for next ones. I hope it's not pike, but I think it's a pike. 
Maybe not, because the heat was absolutely if, like If bite. you need my assistance, just a... No, it's a perch and not so big, but the bite was... It was good and it's about 40 again. This is 40 plus, I believe, and this is Bass Assassin, it works. Oh, good, good. 43. 43? 43? It's yes. precise 43. Ecolotes.eu. <laughs> right and size. <laughs> at the moment, the, the biggest one. 43. Good. So, keep, good. Keep good, casting. Good, good. Erstaunliche Aktion von Team Eholotus.eu, das langsam aber sicher eine sehr starke Top 5 aufbaut. Team Kingfisher Angelreisen, Kamotecki stehen kurz vor einem Spotwechsel. Sie haben sich bereits einen soliden Topwaterplatz gesichert und streben nun die Top 5 an. Team Shimano sucht nach großen Fischen in tiefem Wasser und hat gerade eine interessante Struktur mit einem Fisch in der Nähe gefunden. Kleine Barsche stehen normalerweise in Trupps mit vielen Fischen, während die großen normalerweise weniger zusammenstehen, aber die größten sind oft Einzelkämpfer. Go a little bit like this. There is something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe a pike. Yeah, maybe. But so it's too. No, the, the three was much more down, but we can try it, I think. This? This is bait fish. Bait fish. Yeah. So we can try it yeah, all we, 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 we anchor here. Yeah. Make some casts. Yeah. Let's see. <sighs> it feels so oh, coming. Pop, 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 pop. Uh, yeah. Yeah. What's that? Pike? No perch. Perch, perch. But it's not so big, it's not so big. Not so big, but perch. You're not so big! <laughs> <laughs> not so big! <laughs> so good one! A very good one! Oh, wow, 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 wow! <laughs> you oh, down it! You down it! Oh, I rest my case. Oh. What an emotion! Oh. <laughs> Oh my god. Who is the boss? No. <laughs> oh. Nun, im Moment sind Team Nastroff die Bosse des Bigfish-Punktes mit einer 47 cm Schönheit, während Sporting Seaman den Tom 5 Punkt halten. Aber dieser Fisch könnte diese beiden Punkte an Shimano geben. Schauen wir uns das mal näher an. Yeah. Okay, guys. Just so a lonely warrior standing rocky area, 8-9 meters and totally inhaled it. I fished with a Ned rig. It's a little bit windy, so I used the seven grams. Oh my God. Oh my God, look at this one. Yeah, a beauty. Very beautiful. Very beautiful. Yeah, really healthy one. Now we're talking. Now it's a 48 something. Oh, 49. Ah. No, it's a 48. Yeah, almost 49. <laughs> But 48 is a beautiful, I'm so happy with this one. Yeah, look at her. Yeah. Total amazing perch. And look at those beautiful eyes. It's like purple. Super cool fish. Yeah, unbelievable. Schön gemacht. Neuer Spitzenfisch für Team Shimano und mit 48 cm einen cm länger als der 47er von Team Nice Draft. Sie erhöhen auch ihre Top 5 Länge auf 219 cm, dasselbe wie Sporting Seaman, was ihnen jeweils einen Punkt geben würde, wenn der Tag jetzt enden würde. Pelle hatte recht, der niedrige Luftdruck macht das Fischen langsam, aber er fing tatsächlich einen großen Fisch. Sich an die Umstände anzupassen, indem er mit einer Finesse-Präsentation in die Tiefe ging, besiegelte den Deal für das Team Shimano. Gut gespielt. Der Telefonbericht kommt in wenigen Minuten und Team Nace Droft grindet immer noch an der Stelle, an der sie den ganzen Tag gefischt haben. Tobias mit dem Lipless Crank und Dustin mit dem Tube. Fisch. Small one. No, no, not too small. Look out, Edwin. But also not, it's not a huge one. It's a 30. You sure? No. No, it's, no, it's bigger. Yes. Good. Here, take it, take it. Yes. Oh, it's bigger. It's quite big, Dustin. It's f***ing big, Dustin. It's not as big as the one I lost, but you know, the one you lose are always the biggest, but it's a really nice fish. And it swallowed our uh, tube. Oh, look at this, it's really in the back. You need a plier? No, I think I get it like this. There it is. Ooh, I think it's quite long, Dusty. It's 45 plus. What a nice fish. Well done, Dustin. What a nice fish. Ein weiterer fantastischer Barsch, den Team Nastroft in den letzten Minuten vor dem Bericht gefangen hat. Die Frage ist, ist das ein neuer Bigfish-Punkt oder nicht? 
It is long, Dustin. Nun, lasst uns den 12 Uhr Telefonbericht beginnen, um etwas mehr herauszufinden. Okay, so this is, uh, this is Catch with Care. Hello guys. And, uh, hello. <laughs> We have uh, 64 fish on the, the number. Uh, biggest fish on 36. Top water 30, top 5, 173. Everybody copy? Yep. Yep. Perfect. Here is a Halota CEO, Martins. We have 39 fish. Biggest one is 43. Uh, top water 31. And uh, top 5 we have 200 and uh, three. yes, 3. Just 3. But we are working on that. <laughs> well done. Great. This is Stefan from Team Sporting Seaman. We have 46 fish. Our biggest fish is 46. We have zero on top water and we have 215 centimeter. Nice. Good. Pretty good. Good job. This is Emanuel Svad from Team Headbanger. We have one fish of 33 centimeter. Zero fish on to top waters. Okay. That's it. Okay, so this is Baitoblik, Peter speaking. And we have a biggest fish of 45 centimeter. And we have a top five of 215. And we have a total of 14 fish. And no, nothing on, on, on the top water. Okay guys, hello everybody. This is Pelle speaking from Shimano. Uh, we got the number, seven fish. The biggest one is 48 centimeter. And the total top five is 219. 219? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And zero on uh, top water. Way to go. Good. Thank you. Hello, this is Marius from Team Kingfisher Horizon Camo Tackle speaking. We've got a total amount of five fish. The biggest one is 45. We've got a total top five of 188. And our biggest fish on top water is 45. Oh, congrats. Oh, nice. Wow, good job. Yeah. Good job, yeah, guys. Thank you. Nice one. Not bad. Nice. Thanks, man. Nice fish, nice yeah. fish. Great top good water. Job. Really good fish. Hey, that's Dustin from Team Nace Stroft. Um, we have a total amount of seven fish. Uh, the biggest one is 48, and we have a top five of 223. Nice. Oh, yeah. Hey, that's the wow. boy. Yeah. That's awesome. And nothing on top water. Way to go. Good job, Way to go. guys. Good job. Well done. Okay, awesome. good job, guys. Enjoy the rest of the afternoon, guys. Yes. Yeah. Good luck. Have yeah. a great day. Be safe. Have a great day, everybody. Thank you, Enjoy. guys. Enjoy. Okay, well, have a nice fishing, yeah. everyone. Yeah. Good fishing. Bye -bye. Good bye -bye. fishing. Bye bye. Yeah. See you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. So, yep. Oh, It's but well, well done. Well done, but hey. It's too close to feel comfortable. <laughs> no, of course, but Shimano's uh, really dangerous. I think they are the guys which can mm, yeah, make yeah. it dangerous for us. For sure. So close. Really. So close. close. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah, I think uh, yeah. Oh, but they have a really good five fish and we, you know everybody is big. Yeah. Nice, you know everybody of their fishes are and are look at this in top water of 45. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. oh yeah. <laughs> Good job, man. Oh. So far, it lasts. So it's, it's better than I expected. <laughs> yeah, but top water is, uh, is really hard, 45. Yeah, so we, actually we can check it, but uh, yeah. mostly forget it it's, uh, it's the... until tomorrow. But you know, we are just one cast away from 53, so it's okay. Uh, even, even 49 is playable. <laughs> uh, at this stage, but yeah. at the evening we need 53, so. Okay, uh, okay, move on. Move on. That was tough. That's really tough. What do we do? Yeah, what the heck do we do? The worst part is Kingfisher. Yeah, 45 on top water. Yeah, we can, uh, we can beat that we can for beat sure. That. Yeah. And 150 centimeter plus on top water. Yeah, yeah, we'll do that. Let's do it. But it's quite open still. Yes, yeah, uh, really open. It's, yeah. This is the most probably, all those years I've been in the tournament, this is the most open program number one. Start. We are, CWC is 64. We are you have, sure they had 64? Yeah. Okay. 
Uh, this feels really nice because we are on 64. We are swinging on, it. We are on schedule, so we go all in for the number, don't we? Nombro punto. Seeing you guys next week for more action. Like we said, we go all in this uh, this Perch Pro for the numbers, and we are on schedule. See you next week, guys. Toodaloo! Meine Damen und Herren, das war eine intensive erste Folge, aber lasst mich euch sagen, das war erst die Aufwärmung. Verpasst auf jeden Fall nicht die zweite Folge von Perch Pro am kommenden Freitag um 19 Uhr mitteleuropäischer Zeit. Wenn ihr die Chance haben wollt, selbst am Perch Pro teilzunehmen, registriert euch am besten mit eurem Team für die Perch Pro Open Qualifications im Juni 2023 unter tournaments.kanagratis.se. Die Gewinner gewinnen nicht nur einen Platz in der echten Perch Pro YouTube Edition, sondern sichern sich auch 5000 Euro bares Geld. Wenn ihr nicht bis Juni warten könnt, warum registriert ihr euer Team nicht für die Zander Pro Open Qualifications im März? Oder wenn ihr eher ein Hechtangler seid, schaut euch am besten eine Fly vs. Jerk Open Qualification an, die im Juni stattfindet. Mein Name ist Nick Edler und sie haben sich Perch Pro 9 angesehen.